finna got a check. Live from Gene Autry Way, welcome to Angel Stadium. All set to bring you MLB The Show's Game of the Week. It's the Texas Rangers and the Los Angeles Angels. Alongside Chris Singleton, I'm John Shambi. And we got a rubber match on our hands today, partner. Yeah, the final game of a three-game set. They've split the first two, and regardless of how important a series is within the larger picture of the season, it's a game you want to get up for. Every series win feels good, so... We should see a fun matchup in this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about set to go, and on the hill in this one, Patrick Sandoval. And Singy, it's unique these days, but he's more of a pitch-to-contact type of guy. Yeah, Boo, he doesn't rely too heavily on the strikeout. He knows he needs to miss barrels, get some soft contact, let the defense do work behind him. And I think a guy like that can keep a good tempo, don't give hitters time to adjust or think. They can move through a ball game, and you look up, they're in line for a quality start. We'll see what he's got in this one. The 0-2. 1-2. Fights it off, you'll see another. Kicks and deals. Two and two. That's a laser base hit. Here's Nathaniel Lowe, swinging it well in the series so far. He's five for nine. Swing and a miss. Going one. Going one. one it's one. a pitch out. Nothing doing. And that's ball one. And a pitch. Going to count one and two. That pitch two started two in and ended up on the outside edge. Just changing planes and very difficult especially for a left-handed hitter to track. Two, two. Next offering way upstairs. Yeah, All right, Double play ball to second. There's one. On to Chrome. It's a double play. Sometimes double plays get turned so quickly that you don't really get to appreciate all of the finer details and how these guys execute them. Right there, really nice footwork, and a good feed to second was the key to pulling it off. Swings and crushes one. Right field, way back, and gone. That'll fire up the dugout. His seventh home run of the season. And that gives him a lead. It's 1-0. For a pitcher, the odds are in your favor if you keep that breaking ball down. That time, he got punished for it. Hitter just did a really good job of staying within himself and getting the barrel to the baseball. At the play, Adolis Garcia. Homered last night, added another hit as well. And there's the strike. No ball, one strike. Wouldn't chase that time. And a 1-1. That one lifted to left. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. And that'll do it. Rangers pick up a run here on the solo home run. It's now 1-0. Major League Baseball is on the show. Back in Anaheim, and starting in this one, Jacob DeGrom. Chris, he is a fun one to watch do his thing out there. Well, he comes in carrying a career ERA under three. He's been fantastic yeah. ever since he broke into the big leagues. Can't wait to watch him pitch today. 
Oh, and two as he waves at that one. You know, if in fact Jacob deGrom adds to his Cy Young total as a Ranger, he'll become the first Ranger ever to win the Cy Young Award, and that would leave only the Colorado Rockies as a team that does not boast a Cy Young Award winner. And he'll two. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Such a challenge when a guy's got great velocity. He's throwing a slider over 90 miles per hour. You want to be ready to hit that fastball, but that late break just eats you up every time. Anthony Rendon in the box now. No balls and a strike. Swing and a miss. Oh, and it's 0-2. Swings and misses. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. Here's Shohei Otani. And the first pitch misses for ball one. A little out front there as he swings through it. Swing and a miss. That's strike two. Got him. Strikes out the side to begin the game. What a start. And welcome back. Top of the second. Here's the veteran second baseman, Marcus Simeon. Sandoval back to work. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. He'll circle the bases. It's his eighth home run of the year. And they tack on to their lead. It's 2-0. Well, he went up there, oh, oh, looking to do damage. I think he had his sight set on that pitch. He went and got it and circled the bases. Next is the designated hitter, Ezekiel Duran. Swings through that one. Oh, and one. Always exciting to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. They say you win. Oh, and two. This guy's seen two changeups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. Next pitch one, is two. in the dirt, and the count is one and two. Bounce to third. Moose. On to first, one out in the second. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. Here's Josh Young. Pitch misses oh. there, and it's 1-0. Oh. A swing and a miss, one and, one. and that's strike one. And the next pitch is way outside. Ground ball left side. Fires across the diamond. Got the out. No, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough. Got out in front a little bit. Rolled over on it and beat it into the ground. Mitch Garver stands in here. Leaves that one off the inside. Next pitch is inside. Ball two. After giving up that home run earlier, it just doesn't seem like he wants to challenge him. 2-0. And a big swing and a miss. He got away with one there, but he knows he can't go into that spot very often against a guy like this. That one fouled off. Two and two. pitch spoils that one and it remains two and two and the pitch oh what a stop gathers and throws and very nicely done for the out 
This guy's anticipation is off the charts. Don't see many shortstops better than that. Great job to complete the play and end the inning. Back here at the ballpark, bottom half of inning number two. Now it's going to be Hunter Renfro. Now this is in the air down the line. And Renfro is retired. And there's one away. Woo, he was all over that first pitch fastball. Just barely missed it. Man, this guy was ready to hit. DeGrom, a former Cy Young Award winner, he features a four-seam fastball, a slider, a changeup, a curve, and he works in a two-seamer. The next offering the misses. Now one and two. One ball, two strikes. Gets a piece and stays alive. Here's a one-two. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. Well, he's really dialed in, and this offense is going to have to do something to try to break that rhythm. Maybe it's square around the ball, step out of the box, no agitate him a little bit, do something that just changes what's happening right now because Back at this two. pace it's going to be a long game so you got to figure it out quickly next pitch oh. misses now one and two and down on strikes he goes and good work there as he top half of the third inning digging in Robbie Grossman and a pitch Swing and a miss. Oh, one. Grossman, 33 years old, and he's usually in right today, starting in left. Swing and a miss. Adam out front for the strikeout. He's locked in at the plate when he's using the whole field. He was out in front there, just needs to let the ball travel a little more, and his timing will be back on track. Good pitch for the strikeout. Hammered. Base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Now, no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pitch. You'll often hear the phrase short to it, long through it, and that's a great example of it right there. Got the barrel in the hitting zone early, squared it up with the well-timed swing, and came away with a beautiful line drive in the center field. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Pitch out, but no action. Runner on the goal. That's in for a strike. Throw. Save. Singy, he definitely showed off the wheels there. Yeah, and it turned out to be a bang-bang play. StatCast gives us the data, and that stolen base wasn't possible without that sprint speed. Here comes a pitch. Got him. And there's two away. Just indecisive in that at bat. He couldn't commit to the slider. Tried to sit in between. Just not able to put the bat on the ball. Seeger in I've the box ball. here. Let's that one go for a ball. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. Well, I know they've gotten out to an early lead, but you don't want to take these opportunities for granted. With two outs, still lock in with a quality at Line drive, base hit. Tavares rounds third, headed for the plate. He scores. It's three zip. Well done. Drives in the run. Off the bat, that one registered at 105 miles per hour, man. That is smoking. And these days, you hear it all the time, but the numbers just don't lie. If you can drive a ball like that, more often than not, you're picking up a knock. Two outs, runner at first. Next up for Texas, Adolis Garcia. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. He circles the bases, his 16th homer of the year. It's five zip. Chris, he's homered in back-to-back -back games now. Yep, seeing the ball well, and he's got his timing locked in. He's looking pretty dangerous at the dish right now. Well, you can see he was out front just a little bit. Maybe didn't recognize the changeup earlier, but 
He got the bat head to it, hooked it down the line, and was able to keep it fair for a long home run. Really impressive. Here is Marcus Simeon. Ball one, no, no strikes. With how good these offenses are, there's a lot of ball game left. Swing and a pop-up. Foul at a play off to the right side. That'll find the stands. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Clearly, he hasn't had it in this game, and looks like sooner than later, they're going to have to go to the bullpen. Next pitch inside. Three and one. And there's ball four. Boog, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Moniak makes the grab, and that's the inning. But they strike for three in the inning. Two on this two-run home run. And the lead is now 5 nothing. Back after this on the show. Back here at Angel Stadium, and here is C.J. Crone. That right. one's in there. That's strike one. Well, who would have thought Jacob DeGrom as a college shortstop and then a ninth-round pick by the Mets was going to turn into this good of a pitcher? Back-to-back -back Cy Youngs in both 2018 and 2019. Got it by him for the K. Really love the pitch sequence right there. I'm telling you what, pitcher and catcher on the same page right now. Next to hit, I Luis Rangifo. The wind of the pitch. There's a strike. Yeah, Boog, just incredible. You look at that benchmark of 200 innings, comfortably over that in 2018 with 217. And the sub-2 ERA, just impressive at 1.70 to lead the league. Logan Ohapi stands in now and watches strike one. Ooh. That pitch clips the outside corner. No balls, two strikes. And one and two. It's a good take. Swings and misses on the fastball up in the zone for the strikeout. Welcome back. Now the third baseman, Josh Young. The pitch. Misses outside. And that is ball one. Smash to the left side. And a quick out number one. Mitch Garver up to hit here. 0 for 1. He grounded out in his first at bat. On the ground to the left, Rangifo. And he's safe at first. Oh, that's a really tough play no matter who you are, but I think he has a chance to get him at first if he's just able to get that throw off a little quicker. It looked like he took one extra step to set himself and get a grip on the ball. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Gritchick makes the grab, and there's two gone. On the mound, he's got to remember his offense can score a lot. So if he can hit the reset button from here going forward, there's still a chance that his club can win this ball game. In the air, right side. Renfro in position. He's got it. And that is out number three. Back in Anaheim, bottom of the fourth. And now the center fielder, Randall Gritchick. That catches the zone for a strike. 0-1. Oh, you know, one. these Angels, as this game goes on, have to be more disciplined at the plate. They're chasing a lot of pitches outside the zone, and those chases that are turning into a bunch of outs, can they turn that around and stay within the zone? We'll see, but I think they have to. Misses. It's a ball and two strikes. Struck him out swinging. Slider got him for strike three. Here's Anthony Rendon up to the plate. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. The Angels hitless so far in the game. Strike two. No balls. 
two strikes. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Tasked with one, two, and three to start this inning, but no trouble so far. I'm sure he'd love to strike out the side here. Make a little yeah. statement, but you've got to be composed in this spot. Focus on getting this next guy. you got two good outs. Want to get the third one and avoid the middle of that lineup coming up with a base runner. Could become dangerous. Pitch misses, oh, that's and that's ball one. Outside. That's a ball. Two and two. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Angels go down one, two. Tyler Anderson gets the ball now. Well, they didn't get much length out of their starter in this one, so they've got a lot of outs to eat up in that bullpen. I think they'll look for some length out of him right here if they can get it. Low. Lays off down low as he digs in for the third time. up the middle and a base hit. He's been swinging it really well lately. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. And here's Corey Seager to hit. Crone tossed the second. Back to first. Double play. Two outs. Base is empty. Next to bat will be the Texas cleanup hitter, Adolis Garcia. First offering misses the mark. Action in the Angels' bullpen, Ronaldo Lopez. Up and throwing. Swing and a miss. And it's one and one. Anderson ready to work. That's the ball. Good eye right there. And here it comes. Pulled down the line. This one hammered, but it's foul. Clearly hoping he could get a swing and miss on that, but doesn't fool the hitter with that breaking ball. Nice job. Just couldn't keep it fair. That's ripped. Base hit. That play looks routine defensively, but with all of the little nooks, it can get real tricky down in the corner. Kept it to a long single. Nice defensive play. Now it's Marcus Simeon. That's the third. Moose. They get the force. That ends the frame. And welcome back. Bottom of the inning. Now, Hunter Renfro. Yeah. Right down the shoot, and that is strike one. They've got a potent lineup. And when you think about teams capable of rallying from this yeah. kind of deficit, they're right at the top of the list. 0-2 now. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. Righty delivers. Swings and misses. Slider got him for strike three. Well, right now he's in cruise control, autopilot, just dominating hey, these hitters. He doesn't look like it's a fun at bat. And all of a sudden, you become in awe of this guy on the mound. Somebody's got to break this thing up. That's five straight strikeouts. Got to put a ball in play. Grossman has this one sized up, hauls it in, and there's two away. Here's Mike Mustakis to hit. In there, and it's 0-1. Ah. Mike Moustakis, known as Moose, he was the second overall pick in the 2007 draft. That one ripped. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. Back here at the ballpark, and now Ezekiel Duran. The wind of the pitch. Drilled the left center, way back there, and that is gone. That one felt good. It's his sixth home run of the season, and they add to their lead. It's 6 nothing. And with the six-run lead, there are fans that are starting to head to the exits.
Just an excellent swing all the way around, and it had that sound coming off the bat that gets everyone's attention. Got a pitch to drive, short to the baseball, squared it up, and the backspin carried it out of here. So next to hit for Texas, Josh Young. Fly ball down the line. Renfro getting an angle on it. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one away. It's a good recovery, though, after giving up the home run. Not allowing it to stay in the head, but going to work at the next hitter. And a tough one at that. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. Anderson, a former All-Star, 33 years old. He joined the team as a free agent. Hit hard. That gets through. Now it's Robbie Grossman. On the ground, two ball. To second, there's one. On to first, double play. And that's the inning. Texas extends the lead with the solo shot. It's now a 6 nothing ball game. You're dialed into the show. Back here at Angel Stadium. Well, we go bottom six. So in now for the Angels, C.J. Crone. That's in there. That's strike one. Clearly down in this ball game, and you can't look at the deficit and try to get it all back in one swing. It's got to come one at bat at a time and even shrink it down smaller, pitch to pitch. Make that guy on the mound work to get you out. Cuts on it and misses. That's a strikeout. Some high cheese for strike three. Oh, this guy's been pretty much a non-factor so far this weekend. No, Very little in the way of impactful at-bats and quality at-bats and let alone contact. That's the sixth time they've set him down on strikes in the series. So no doubt frustration mounting and very high right now. Going to count one and two. Man, he was really tardy on that fastball. Great job of setting him up by throwing the curveball. Add some velocity to it on the next pitch. Can't catch up. Two balls, two strikes. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Well, I've always said it's tough. A elevated fastball you see so well, hard to lay off of. Well, when you're talking about 100 miles per hour, chances oh, of catching one. up are next to none. So you see that one just blown right by him. I think you're going to have to start a lot earlier if you're going to catch up to that speed. One and one. The Halos yet to pick up a hit here. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. That's out to center field. Tavares settles under it. Drops into the glove. And that ends the inning. We go to the top of the seventh. Here's the center fielder, Leody Tavares. And that's, that's just foul. foul. Base hit, center field. Well, oh, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Wow. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. Low. The next to hit takes ball one. One for three. In the air to left center. Moniak tracks it down for the out. So now it's Corey Seager. He's already homered here in this one. Double play ball to second. Good feed. That's one. And yet another twin killing. They're fourth. Of Welcome back. Randall Gritchick now. That one's in there. Strike one. You know, he's been so great today. Really just throwing whatever the catcher puts down. I mean, hasn't shaking off the catcher very much at all today. Riding to the plate. Struck him out looking. A big performance on the mound. Lots of strikeouts. That was number 14. Yeah, clearly trusting his stuff in this one, Boog. Feeling really good about what he's working Doing with. And that really allows a guy to attack hitters. You know, such an important mindset to have out there on the mound, especially when you're ahead in the count with two strikes. The pitch. 
Hit on the ground, and it gets through. Just like that, the perfect game is gone. So the perfect game bid comes to an end, and now we'll see what he's got left in the tank and how they'll play it on the mound moving forward. But Singy, he's been a lot of fun to watch in this one. Yeah, Boog, really impressive from the very beginning. I mean, this guy was in total command the whole time, attacking hitters, and really he's made them look pretty long. In there safely. The 2 on. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Rendon around third. These guys today are so great with handling velocity. They're seeing high speeds day after day, and a nice job of turning that one around. Met at first. Now it's Hunter Renfro. Ball one there. Oh. Next offering is in for a strike. Hit on the ground to the right side. Fires to second for one. To first, not in time. Great effort there. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. The 0-1. Swings through that one. Just an outstanding job of spinning the baseball, moving it around, doing what he does. Renfro, the runner at first with two gone. You see how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try top. And there's the third out. That'll do it for the inning. Now a right-handed arm out of the bullpen, Ronaldo Lopez. Well, they need someone to stop the bleeding and keep the score right where it is. Seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is swinging it. Garcia at the plate now. That's ball one. Swing and a miss. One ball, one strike. That was straight queso right there. Next pitch is outside. Next offering is fouled back. Kicks and fires. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. That one misses. So a leadoff walk. Boog, if I were him, I'd be nibbling around the plate as well. I mean, this guy is just capable of hitting pitches outside of the zone and driving them a long way. Simeon stands oh. in now, looks at that one inside. Activity in the bullpen for the Angels. Dominic Leon appears to be getting loose. Swing and a miss. One and, one. and the count is one and one. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move till the very last moment. Oh, Incredibly okay. difficult to pick that up. Just kind of have to tip your cap on that pitch. The one one. Maybe a two ball. Five, four, three. And they turn the double play. I think there's always something pretty about watching a 5 4 3 double play get turned. I mean, just seeing the ball whipped around the diamond with quickness and accuracy, that was nice. On the ground to short. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. And yeah, the batter now, Josh Young. Now move to first. Ow! They got him, and that will end the inning. On to the bottom of the eighth. Here's the third baseman, Mike Moustakis. That clips the zone, and it's 0-1. DeGrom still out there to pitch the eighth and working with a big lead. He's been excellent, really on his game in this one, and at this point, he wants to finish what he started. Next offering oh. misses down and away. Is there a debate to be One, had two. about shutting him down, maybe to preserve some bullets given the score? Absolutely. When you consider over the course of a long season, guys putting a lot of stress on that elbow, on that shoulder, but you also have to pry the ball out of a hand of a guy like this. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. And it's off the wall. Garcia throws to second. In there. That's a double. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there.
anytime you smoke a ball off the wall, you kind of think about what it could have been. But obviously, you have to be happy with that result. Strike two. I went two. Off the plate oh. inside. One and two to count. One ball, two strikes. Crone over at second, one down. That oh. misses the zone, and the count's even at two. And now the count filled up three and two. Full count. The three two so is off four, the outside edge, and that is ball four. Very close off the outside corner. Could have easily been called a strike in that location. Ohapi batting with one down takes a strike. Off the mark no, there. It. That's a ball. And it's a ball and a strike. Comes up empty. That's one strike two. two. One out. Runners at first and second. Well, just about to hit that century mark. A hundred pitches for this game. This one high in the air to left center. Tavares brings it in with a nice run and grab. Back to the top of the Angels lineup. Randall Gritchick, the next yeah. to hit for the Angels. In no there ball. for one strike side. one. And there's a ball. Nope. ball. One and one. Out to center. Tavares settles under it. And makes the grab. And that's the third out. All set to start the ninth in this one. Now the third baseman, Josh Young. Lopez back to work. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Lopez, 6-1 righty, 29 years old. And they traded for him earlier this year. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. Ohapi makes the grab, one down. That was a good, hard fastball with some up, nice up, ride up, up in the zone right there. Up. Hitter looked like he was on it, but I think that velocity at the end just beat him. Instead of a line drive or something hit. Deep to pop up and an easy out for the defense. So they're making a move for a bat off the bench. Jonah Heim, one out, the base is empty for him. Swings and misses and one down below the zone. And now it's even up. At the belt and fires. And a swing and a miss. Next pitch is outside. Rip to right center, and that one will leave the park. Out of here. That was a moonshot. Third home run of the season. It's 7-1. That's their fifth homer of the game. Man, they're all getting into the action. It's starting to feel like a home run derby up here. It's so tough to come in as a pinch hitter and have success. I mean, you really have to keep yourself locked into the game and ready at any time. So it's always impressive to me when someone jumps in there and hits it out. It's a huge lift for your ball club as well. Robbie Grossman stepping in for the Rangers. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Yeah, that you skips in the dirt. If you you're the pitcher, you've got to go right at this guy. It's the number nine hitter in the lineup. You can't be afraid of contact in this situation. Left field, Moniak drops steps, heads back on it. Flashes the leather on the run and catch. Two down. Here's Leody Tavares. He was the big part of the field last time. Nice liner to center. And that one is lifted in the air. Moniak gliding as he moves to his left. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is that. But add on one more as the solo shot stretches their lead even further. It's 7-1.
Staying in the game on defense, Jonah Heim. He takes over behind the plate to do the catching after entering the game as a pinch hitter. Rendon leading things off and takes a strike. Now playing left, number 16, Travis Jankowski. The pitch. On the ground. Over to low. That takes care of Rendon. Shohei Otani up to the dish. In there at the knees. That's strike one. Oh and one. And that's outside. Oh, outside. Swing and a miss. One and two. Bouncer to Young. Slings it across, and they're down to their last out. Hunter Renfro at the plate. Slice to right. Fair ball. And that rolls into the corner. Takes the turn. He's digging for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. The tag, and that's the ball game. It seemed like from the first pitch of this ball game, this guy was going to get it done. A quality start. Who knew he'd throw a complete game and get the victory? But an excellent job of continuing to just throw what the catcher put down. He navigated through this ball game, a jam here, a jam there, but ultimately it was an outstanding outing. And a 7-1 finish in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.